it's very primal in a way when you behead someone's head, like it's a bit uncivilized. This is probably not a very nice thing to say, but it's within us to do it actually, you know, before civilization and everything. If you go to these rural areas in Indonesia, there are stories like this. Like, for example, the writer of the story who came up with the idea actually saw someone beheading someone else in the market when he was having lunch. And I think it's interesting to see how this happened in Indonesia, like in, in, in these areas, in this time. For me, it took me a while to get into the film. I'm looking for ways to approach it, to make it mine, because it was an idea from another director, and uh, I think the challenge for me is to make it mine. Making it into a Western, it is actually one of my tools to actually do that. The Western is not really popular back in Indonesia. I didn't really watch a lot of Westerns during, in my younger days. But I think that's like a good thing because then I'm kind of have the liberty of being very objective about it and play around with it. So the film, instead of being a slave of the genre, it's the other way around.